yes, 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 I know. Um, this is my fourth video that I'm filming for today. Um, someone gave me an idea, or not really an idea, oh, well yeah, I guess an idea, or asked if I would film, because I know a lot of my subscribers have come from AEC, which is Alter Ego Clothing. Um, there is a group on Facebook called uh, Waist Training 101 by Alter Ego Clothing. So I thought I would do a video based off of many recommendations on my waist training and, you know, things like that. So, this video is going to be very raw. I think I will upload this video, like I will edit this video and upload it ASAP since um, this is a very requested video and my other two videos will be up in the next few days. I already uploaded a new video, so when you're seeing this, my video that I'm talking about right now is already up and live, so go ahead and watch that. Support your girl. But anyways, if you want to see more about my waist training journey, just keep on watching. Please keep in mind, disclaimer, my child is in the, you can see her in the background acting crazy. Um, I was having her, you know, play on the floor, so the floor is crazy as well, but I really want to film this video. Okay, so a little backstory on Ultra Ego clothing. Um, you can buy waist trainers on there, yes. And before I get any comments asking how do they purchase theirs, um, you need to be in the group, the waist training group, which is called Waist Training 101 by Ultra Ego Clothing. And in their announcement section, which I will film on my iPhone, I guess, and insert it after I'm done talking about this, um, where to find all that information. And you'll just go under the announcements and you need to like measure yourself so you need to have like one of those cloth measuring I want to say measuring tape but like you know you know what I'm talking about it's meant it's bendy and you can wrap it around your body and stuff and you need to get measurements of your body and I believe it's like four or five different measurements like around your waist like from your belly button then your actual literal waist which is at the bottom where your hip bones are then one from like the underneath your bust all the way to the, it gives a lot so but the group goes very in depth. This group is very, very supportive. And if it wasn't for this group, I probably wouldn't have bought the waist trainer. Like watching and seeing everybody's results killed me. Like absolutely killed me. I was shook about how well everybody's doing. And once you guys see, cause I'm gonna show you what my stomach actually looks like, not in my waist trainer. Um, you guys are gonna be like, wow. So I have goals that I wanna reach. I will hopefully get there. Um, I just realized my shirt has a hole in it, but yeah, life of a mom. <laughs> okay, so this is my waist trainer. My waist trainer is the 26 um, short regular because I have a short torso. So the reason why they want you to send your measurements to the group, um, like the page itself, is because they need to like match you with a corset that's for your body. So like for me, mine is short because if I, I need to be able to sit with the corset on, um, so this is what it looks like. Like mine's already laced, of course, you know. It comes laced as well. I was kind of dumb enough to like unlace it because it wouldn't fit for me the, at the very beginning. But once I relaced it, I found a video on how to relace your corset and all that kind of stuff. So you see how mine's like not parallel at all, but this is what it looks like when I took mine off yesterday. Um, and then it has like the bunny ears. Sorry, I'm holding it like this, where you can like lace it up and stuff. So I will lace up for you guys so that way you can see how I personally lace up. The only problem with this is that I won't have a mirror to go based off of to make sure that I am, you know, parallel. And what I mean by parallel is that the these, like exactly how it is right now, that's parallel. If it's like this, it's not parallel. If it's like somewhat bent in the middle, it's not parallel. And that matters because then you can warp your corset and you probably will not get the, re the correct results that you're looking for. Um, I've been waist training for about, I don't even know, like two months inconsistently. I say inconsistently because there are some days, like if I'm not feeling well, I won't lace up. Like today, it was my day off. I was laced up for like eight hours yesterday. So I was like, oh, I'm not going to do it today just so I can have a chance to relax. Because tomorrow when I go back to work, I will lace up again. And if you're wondering what am I doing, I'm just reopening it up some so I can put it on. So I'm going to go ahead and put the camera a little bit down so y'all can see so this is what my stomach looks like not with the corset so like but you can just see like like yeah I have a mom pouch like a pretty decent sized mom pouch um, this is what my stomach looks like in the front so yeah I this is my goal is to get rid of 
this. Like, I don't want this. I want to be like, even when I suck in, you can still see that. But I know with consistent waist training, I will, like, you know, fix that. But, yeah. So I wanted to show that to start with. I probably should take off this shirt so I can do this properly. So I'm just going to take the corset like this. Have it like this. And then I try to, like, push it so that way the flap comes down. I just wrap it around. Okay. So then I just put the clasps on. So if you're large chested like me, <laughs> if you're large chested like me, you would understand the struggles of not being able to see below your chest. So like right now you might be like, oh, she's struggling to get that thing on. It's because my chest is in the way. But there you go. So now I have it all buckled in and everything, and you can see that it looks normal. So now I'm gonna grab my, the bunny ears. I'm gonna grab the top, the top one. I'm gonna wrap my hands around it like this. I will turn around. I'm gonna see if I can do this on camera. And I just pull. Ugh. Obviously you can see that it is not parallel at all. Then I'm gonna try to grab the bottom ones. Do the exact same thing with pulling my arms around and then pull the bottom. So obviously I cannot see if I'm parallel or not. So I tightened it. Yes, Luna, shh. I know that on the group, like when you have, when you have, your, when you first get your, your corset, you need to. Sorry about my chest. You need to make sure that um, you are only having a certain amount of reduction. I believe two inches is the maximum amount of reduction. Sorry, y'all. I'm trying to check the mirror. Oh, I got it the first time. Perfect. So, um, I'm just going to tie it. So I'm going to grab both, pull it just a little, just to make sure. And then I'm going to just tie it. So pull it like this, like, like you would tie your shoes, I guess, is a good way to compare it. And then you just pull it. And then the excess, because you have a lot of excess string I'll just tuck in so sometimes I like to take my uh, my uh, pants and like do one of these numbers because then it makes it look like your waist is even tinier than it actually is but well I want to say actually is but it really is this tiny when you have the waist trainer on um, I'm gonna put my shirt back on because my chest is just wanting to be a little extra and this is a family show I'm just kidding um, so yeah, anyways, back what I was saying with the reduction thing. So there, there is like, I think it's 20 days. I can't remember honestly because it's been a little bit of time for me since I've done the seasoning part. But basically seasoning is where you're breaking in your corset so then that way it, um, forms to your body. Because clearly when you first get the corset, it's not, or the waist trainer, whatever you wanna, whatever terminology you wish to use, it's not gonna automatically form to your body. It's brand new. So it's gonna be uncomfortable. It's not gonna feel very good. But once you're done with the seasoning process, so like every single day, like the very first day you get it, you can only wear it, I think it says two hours. I think it says two hours, don't quote me on that. Then day three is two hours, day four, like, and then it'll bump up to two and a half or three and a half. All this information you can find on the Waist Trading Group. I can link this um, down below in the description box, and that way you have more information on where to get it and how to do it. Um, let me see. So, like, now you can see, like, I look more snatched. Like, so, yeah, I still have, like, this flap here, which is the corset. But once it forms to my body a little bit more, which I still have time, it'll be like And then also it does make your chest stick up a little bit more as well. But yeah, so that's what when you when you guys see my photos like on Instagram when I'm like super cinched, this is what it is. Um, but yeah, so seasoning takes about I think 20 days. Like I said, you can find that on the Facebook group. Um, and then it forms to your body and then it feels a lot better. So like right now I wear mine to work eight hours a day. As soon as I leave the building at work, I am, as soon as I get to my car, I am unwrapping myself to get out of it because I can feel my stomach. Always listen to your body. Always listen to your body. Sometimes it's, um, for me, it's a little harder to get it off because um, if I'm at work, I just can't stop what I'm doing and take it off. Stop. My child's being really extra today. But yeah, so just listen to your body. 
I promise you this was the best investment of my life like I'm not even gonna lie um, my corset I believe was a hundred and 50 or 160 dollars um, people would say oh my god that's a lot of money like what anyways so yeah 160 dollars I feel like is not a bad investment when you're doing it for yourself you know what I mean they do have a payment plan where um, I don't really I don't really know much like in depth about it because um, I don't I didn't do it I just paid for it outright because um, I really wanted it at the spot but I know that if, if you could just make payments on it and as soon as you make your last payment then they'll go ahead and start making yours and then ship yours um, so you could like put money aside however much money you need to until you get enough to be able to purchase it so I really do love that about AEC as well that they could do like a little layaway thing uh, yeah that's what it is it's like layaway but yeah this was like the best investment of my life like I feel cinched to the gods I feel absolutely amazing in this like when I wear this to work I feel like everyone stops and just like does a double take looking at me and I feel like this is just a whole nother part of me now um, I am not consistent with it which I wish I was but with my my schedule you know with Luna even though that's not an excuse um, it's just sometimes it's not easy to do especially when I'm sick and I don't want to like feel even more sick but yeah so I hope you guys enjoyed this video after this I will include a clip from my phone um, showing exactly how you navigate the group so then that way you can figure out how to purchase and how to move on into your waist training journey thank y'all have a good one have a good morning evening night whatever get to the group so once you join waist training 101 um, it's gonna make you have to wait to get approved but it usually takes very quickly to get approved so once you've gotten to the announcements page you just click on so it says you right here it says, thank you for visiting the pin post so when you click continue reading it brings you an entire like literal list of everything that you could possibly need like the payment plan stop please the payment plan measuring tips how to measure like an actual video and literally anything you could possibly think about like what is seasoning how do i measure reduction i have gaps aec styles um what is if that's parallel like all kinds of things like that it's all listed for you right in here so everything that you could possibly need is in this part of the group very simple very easy they make it easy for us